Hi, this is John. Um, this is the first in a, an occasional series of little videos um, showing you how to do basic jobs on a Land Rover. Uh, in my case it's a Series 3, although it's fitted with a 200DI engine. Um, just to start off, something nice and simple. Um, nothing to be scared of if you've never touched a car before. Uh, in this case I'm just going to adjust the handbrake. Um, I just removed the driver's seat base and the seat box cover. Uh, this exposes the handbrake, which you can see here. And, of course, in addition, the fuel tank. For petrol tanks, you'll only have the one pipe, which would be the feed to the um, engine. Because it's a diesel, we've got a return as well. This is the top of a fuel sender um, with three connectors, one to earth and one to the fuel level and one to the low fuel warning light. On most petrols you'll only have one of these to the fuel level um, but with diesels it's much more important not to run out of fuel as often the, the pumps will need priming although in my case it's self priming. Okay so nice simple job to start with. Let's just pop that there. Now this is the adjuster for the handbrake. Um, the top nut is just a lock nut the other the, the the lower one is the one that actually does the adjusting so having chopped the vehicle just let off the handbrake first as you can see there's some play there you do need some um, a couple of clicks worth so if we just loosen off the lock nut first then all we need to do is tighten the lower nut to take out play if I can get to it like that which means that the handbrake will activate a bit sooner so if I now still do it a bit more I think on mine quite a bit of play in there still a tiny bit more but that's the general principle and then when you're happy just run the lock nut back down and tighten him off again now while you're under here you may as well grease the, the pivot points make sure it's all nice and free moving um, in this case I serviced it not long ago so it's still got plenty of grease there's the uh, lower points down there as well okay so first little job done and saved a few quid over paying a garage to do it